You'd think that what you see here is just another convertible laptop, and even the branding would lead you to believe that this is another iteration of the HP Envy series. But it's not. Oh, it is definitely not. I'm Jaime Rivera with Pocket Now, reporting from the Snapdragon Tech Summit in Hawaii, and let's talk about the always connected PC with this new HP Envy X2 and the ASUS Nova Go. Today sees the birth of a new category of computer. The always connected PC is a full-blown Windows 10 computer that's now powered by the Qualcomm Snapdragon 835. This means a couple of significant things that make these computers stand apart from a standard PC. First of all, as the name states, these computers are always connected, thanks to the technology provided by the Snapdragon 835 processor because it's like if you were using a cell phone processor here. Second is that it's an extremely power-efficient computer, once again, thanks to all the mobile technology provided by the Snapdragon 835. It doesn't really matter if it's the HP Envy X2 or the ASUS Nova Go, you're getting 20 plus hours of battery life. Third is the non-compromise experience. Believe it or not, the 10 nanometer process on the Snapdragon 835 is powerful enough to run Windows 10. And for those of you worrying about applications, x86 apps run just fine through emulation. And it doesn't really matter if you've got Windows 10 S or Windows 10 Pro, it'll run just fine. Fourth, the new HP Envy X2 is the perfect example of how slim designs can become. It looks like a Surface Pro 4 from a distance, but it's far slimmer in thickness. We're talking about a machined aluminum build that's slim and light enough to be used like a tablet, or you can turn it into a computer thanks to this keyboard case. Ports include USB-C, a headphone jack, micro SD expansion, and most important, a SIM tray to remain connected to the internet. Tucked inside, we have the Qualcomm Snapdragon 835, 8GB of RAM, 256 gigs of storage, and even if this computer is set to run Windows 10 S, you can upgrade for it to run other versions of Windows just like a regular PC. This is also a worldview camera, allowing this PC to access 3D and AR tools in Windows 10, and yes, there's stylus support through Windows Inc. And then fifth, we have the ASUS Nova Go. This being the more laptop-like model that brings less of an inspired design, but a more conventional computer with standard USB ports, HDMI, and a form factor that can be set into tent mode, laptop mode, you name it. Specifications are nearly the same when compared to the Envy, Snapdragon 835, options for 6 or 8 gigabytes of RAM, 256 gigabytes of storage, and Windows Inc. is also supported through a stylus, and there's even a fingerprint scanner that provides Windows Hello support. So for those of you asking yourself, what's the catch? Literally, there is no catch. This is, again, the future of computing as we see it. If you want to notice any sort of a difference between how apps run on this or a regular Windows 10 PC, apps will probably take about a second longer to launch, but after that, they'll work just fine. All in all, I have to say that I am extremely impressed with these offerings. I feel at least when it comes to those who need computing on the go, this is definitely the best option to buy. They're definitely not powerful gaming computers, but that's what other processors and platforms will serve you for. I mean, the price tag is between six to $800, so definitely this is more a mobile computer than anything else. You can bet that I personally can't wait to give either of these computers a try, as our review units are set to arrive very soon. While that happens, chime in the comments, let us know what you think about the always connected PC. First of all, do you like the name or not? I wish they came up with a shorter name. And while you're at that, you can also subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one. Each card will lead you to some of the more recent hot videos that we published, and you can also follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera, on Instagram at Jaime Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one.